Good morning, everybody. I just thought I'd do a check-in this morning. I uh, made a decision yesterday that a smart thing I could do is rent a storage unit in town where I work all the time. Um, it's, it is another expense, but it's not very much. It's a complete tax write-off. And something cool at this storage unit I'm at I can actually put insurance on my locker. So I've got about 10,000, I think, in coverage for tools in my locker. This locker is right in the middle of town here. And I can get in anytime from 6 a.m. to 10 p.m. or I can send a message and get in after hours if I need to. Um, I got me a 10 by 10 and th what this is for is my tools that are just too big i'm getting to where i've got so many larger tools that uh, i just can't keep on going with everything jammed in my tool tray it's just making it inconvenient so this is my solution right here you can see what we're dealing with. So far, I put my tile saw, mixers, extra curdy, and all my clean out supplies. Uh, everything I need for tile work is in here right now. As that was being my biggest problem. When you have a trailer, I, my trailer is a 7 by 21, which is huge. But if you want to be efficient out of it, you can't start putting items like a full tile saw right in the aisle and then things like that table saws and all that are fit right in but jobs where i need a tile saw typically it's two to two days at the most that the saw needs to be on a job site so i can run by here it's right in the middle of town pick it up take it to the job drop it off i'm all set and this way also, if I'm on a tile job, I don't even need my trailer. Once I've framed everything in for the tile job, sheetrocked, got it ready, I can just pick up my tile gear in the back of the truck, drop it off at the job. I'm set for a couple of days, drop it back in here. It doesn't have to be at my house and I have a lot more room. I, It's probably an extra $10, $15 a month at this particular storage unit because it's, it's a very nice location in town dead center i pretty well drive past it on my way in every day so i i can't hardly go wrong with this if i forget a tool while i'm in town that's over here i'm within two miles of it no matter where i'm at in this town so anyway let's see what you guys think as contractors handymen have you found it worthwhile to do something like this this will be my first month with it. I think I $65 a month is what this will cost me. Really is completely insignificant. If it just saved me a few trips all the way out to my house for a tool a month, it's going to pay for itself easily. That and actually be able, being able to use my work trailer more efficiently without having to climb over tools that, I, that are not often used. So I'm gonna slowly move all of my large stuff in here, put some racking up the walls and get everything in here that's in my way. So anyway, just see what you guys think and uh, let me know how they've worked out for you and anything special you may have done with one. If you've built something in yours to make it more usable and whatnot, let me know, give me some ideas. I'll check in with you all later.